Hey guys, I'm LB, and welcome to episode 2, the third episode of Parallax. We are back in this puzzle that we left off at the end of on the last episode. I'm completely fumbling my words, but whatever. So our exit's over there, as the game made very, very sure to inform us of when we entered the level. It does kind of annoy me that we can't move whenever it's telling us where the exit is. Right, let's go through here, since that's the only thing we really can do. And we've got more of these laser things that kill us, but really just block our movement. I'm not sure- like, the game previously didn't have these laser things, and it would just have platforms blocking the way. But I guess the platforms weren't good enough, and now it's added these laser things, which are exactly the same purpose in every single shape and way. Yeah, these serve exactly the same purpose, but it looks like we can rotate this one with that switch over there, so that's something to be aware of. Yeah, they, they serve the same purpose as the platform blocking the way, so I'm not sure why the game felt the need to introduce them. Why? What? <laughs> what is the purpose of this? Why does this exist? Why is this a thing that even exists at all? Like, I get that it's supposed to make it so that I can only travel in one direction on this path, but... an alternative way to make a one-directional path is to just make a slight incline here that then drops down and you can't jump back up. And that would be much less frustrating and much more obvious in terms of its purpose than whatever the heck this monstrosity of a contraption is. And see, this is also more frustrating. With the- with the vertical- vertical slant and a drop, it's nowhere near- anywhere near as frustrating as whatever this is. Well, anyway, I've- I've- I've exercised my right to complain about this game plenty. Let's get on with the puzzle, I suppose. Or quote-unquote puzzle, anyway. Uh, what do actually I actually need to do from here? Oh, I only pressed one of these buttons, didn't I? Which one did I press? Did I press that one? Or this one? What does this one do? Oh, it rotates that. Okay, let's press that first. Now what? Uh, actually can't really do much, can I? Eh, well, perhaps that's useful in some way. Let's go through here and... Isn't that what I just did, though? What am I doing? I think... Yeah, I think I did just rotate these, so... Oh, come on. I fell off again! It's really easy to fall off in this game for some reason. Hmm. Can't really do anything else in here, can I? What am I missing? Maybe I didn't need to rotate that. Oh crap, that's not what I wanted to rotate! Ah, oh, it fell off again. Like, there's no reason for the platforms to be this thin. Like, there's... I don't know, it, it's for the aesthetic of the game. The, the platforms are all thin like this, because that's the aesthetic. And it is a cool aesthetic, it does look cool, but functionally, it's really annoying. Wait, what? What did I just... That's not what I wanted to do, actually. I'm so confused now, I don't even know what I just did. I want it to be like that, and then this one is the one I want to be the other way. There we go. Let's walk through here. Go around, carefully. Lots of walking. Lots of walking. And then go through out here. Ah, those are the wrong way. So I did want to press that button. You know what, let's just restart. <laughs> Come on, let me move please, thank you. with this monstrosity of a creation. Who puts this in a puzzle game? Really. Let's press this. Come on. Then we walk back through here, walk all the way around. 
the way around. And now we're back to here, and these should be the right way around. There we go. That was all it took. Right. So our scripted path would continue, had that been open. Let's do this now. There we go. Functionally the same as a platform block in the way. Except a lot more frustrating, because it's deadly. Because why... why else would it not be deadly? There we go, that's done some stuff to make us do more work. Now I've gotta deal with this contraption again, because of course I do. There we go. Right, maybe we just rinse and repeat. Actually, it might be correct the way it is. Hmm. I think it's correct the way it is. So I need to... need to do this first... to uncorrect it, and then do this to recorrect it. Yeah! And then I need to actually get out of here. I'm not really sure what the whole point of this area was, because, I mean... we just keep going in a circle, around and around. Not much of a difference, honestly. Alright, well. Let's continue onward. The music changed, didn't it? Why did the music change? Does it know that I've completed the level? Or did it... has it always been doing that, I've just been in the dark world whenever it was doing that? That was weird. Well, there's that sound effect I love. Actions 9 out of 8? Ah, oh, well, something I did was unnecessary, whatever. On to the next. Goals on the underside of that platform, so our goal is to rotate it. What the? Interesting. What is this? Does it connect to that? And if so, how do I know what it's connected to? Or is it just always in the other world? So, is the point of that just to be a portal that I can't go through, but platforms can? I think that's what you're trying to tell me. Let's just assume I needed to press that button. So that's what I rotated. What's over here? Another button, huh? Sure, why not? Wait, the- it does- it went to the other button! <laughs> you can power buttons with other buttons? That's weird. Yeah, you can totally power buttons with other buttons, that's funny. Oh, what- what- what is the point of this? <laughs> what? Why is this even a thing that exists? What? I don't- I don't get the point of that. That is bizarre. Like, you could literally remove these laser things and make these not be going up and down. It would be exactly the same. I'm so confused what the point of any of this is. Hmm. Alright, well, I've already rotated this the way it needs to be. I think I need to rotate this one, though. Oh, that's not what I expected. But I need it to be out of the way, if I'm gonna do this stupid jumping puzzle thing here. This is something that annoys me, like, why would this be in the game? This is, like, literally insulting to the player to put this in a quote-unquote puzzle game. No puzzle game should ever have something like what I'm seeing right in front of me right now. This is the dumbest thing I've ever seen. And I mean that literally. Well, I, I mean, not the dumbest, but it's dumb for- in this game. It's the dumbest thing I've seen in this game. Yep, that kills me. What else can we do in here? We can rotate that platform. 
just rotate this for now and see what we're working with on this side. Come on now. Yep, that's what I was concerned about. I could technically go under it, but then I wouldn't be jumping. So... what to do instead? Our goal is to press that button at some point, and then being able to go back. bit out of the way for now. There we go. Hmm. Not much to be done here, is there? way to rotate that... is with that button over there. but there's not much point to doing that. Yeah, like, why would you do that? Oh, that actually lets us do exactly what I needed to do. Alright, I see now. That's what I was missing. Now I can press this. Let's try that again. There we go. Now... Now, if we get to the other side though- oops, come on now. I just wanna walk around and see what I'm doing without worrying about walking off the edge. I think we're gonna rotate this the other way. What rotates that one again? Is it this one? Yes. Come on. So now we need to go across over here. And rotate this around. And now, we can do this stupid insulting jumping puzzle. Quote unquote puzzle. Why is this a thing? Why does this even exist? Why? And I fell. Because of course I did. Oh, and it saves me back here. And that goes... yeah, the exit. Not flipped over. Alright, well the exit's available to us now. So now we just gotta get back there. <laughs> Should be annoying enough. Uh... What did I need to do again? Right, I need to rotate this one first of all. That one was the center... Yeah, because I'm going to go to that side eventually. How did I rotate this again? Right, I need to hit that. Alright. So I just said rotate this again. Oh, but I rotated that, yeah. How did I do that again? <laughs> Right, with this. I didn't need to press this button yet, that's why. Right. Come on. Alright, that's the wrong button. I'm glad I didn't press it. 
now we do this. We need to press that button. Or actually, we're just done. Okay, never mind. We'll press it for fun. There we go. Yep, 25 out of 10 actions. Uh, that's pretty much exactly what I expected. Why do I have a mouse cursor on top of my mouse cursor? Are you guys seeing this? Yes, you are seeing this. Well, I have a mouse cursor on top of my mouse cursor. I think I noticed that earlier, but didn't comment on it. <laughs> Weird. Felt like I had more, se more than seven deaths, though. Huh. What does this do? Again, why... why must you put these... underneath the platforms? Like, I can't actually know that it splits like that unless I actually fall underneath here. That's very annoying. Like, you could just put this on top, above me, so I can see where it goes. Hmm. Let's get a lay of the land first. Interesting. These go quite on... It's going quite... Oh, they have... They have a white outline. Didn't notice that. Huh. Do they have the opposite color outline in the opposite color world and I just never noticed? What... What did I even hit? Oh, I hit that. Okay. I can't even tell how these ant lines are connected to each other because of the way the perspective works. It's really annoying that I can't see the actual connections here. Hmm. Let's head through here. And we can't do anything here. Gotcha. Right, let's actually press this button for once. Yep, just does that. Now we can do stuff. Whoa. It, oh, come on. <sighs> so we can get these out of sync if we wanted to. That's interesting. Why would we want to, though? I don't think there's a good reason to do that. Why would we want to get them out of sync? That is genuinely perplexing. We can't do this yet, because we'll just run our- run our face into this. Again, exactly the same function as if there was just a platform there, but we would fall to our death instead. have a black outline. Yeah, you can see it here. there, right? How are we ever supposed to get over there? Because this is blocked, and the only way to unblock it is to press with the buttons over there, right? Am I missing something? And there's nothing out here, there's no reason to send ourselves careening out into space. Whee! Goodbye! <laughs> Yeah, there's no reason to do that. What am I missing? There's like nothing I can do. I don't get it. Am I supposed to like time it so that I go through right when these are rotating? Nope. I went a bit earlier that time, I meant to go later. At least the checkpoint's right there. I 
I'm not even sure I understand what happened there. <laughs> oh, that was hilarious. The rotation of it kicked me out in this direction. <laughs> I got smacked in the face by it. Oh, that's great. I still can't do this, though. Yeah, I'm, I have no idea what I'm doing right now. So let's see what rotating this does. Pretty sure that does not help me in the slightest, and I fell off again. I mean, that lets me do that, but that th that's no different than what I could do already, so... I don't actually understand what the point of that is. And then this will just kill me. No, I won't, but whatever. It's the same difference. Oh, come on. That's not what I wanted to do, and you know it. There we go. Oh, I see. I see now. I want to be able to go between them. Right, so, let me rotate this the other way. There is no way to walk faster in this game. There's no sprint key or anything. I checked. This, and then we can go through here, and that one is... Wait, what? That's not what I wanted. What? What? I want it this way, don't I? No, because I still can't do anything there. Well, then what's the point of this? Is there something out over there? I'm so confused right now. I don't understand what I'm doing. Oh, I haven't been able to get here before. I've completely forgot that this area existed. Alright. Alright, alright. That's worrying. Okay then. Well, I sure hope that's something I was supposed to do, because it's been done now. Oh, I'm gonna have to do that twice. Because that other one just does this one that I just ran into. And then they'll both be in the way, and then I'll have to come back and do it again to press that button to get them both out of the way. That's a nightmare. In terms of tediousness. Right. Uh... What do I actually want to do here? Come on. So let's rotate these around. That sounds good to me. Then we can go through here. We don't want to put those back in sync just yet. Because we want to press this first. Yep, like that. Faster. Oh, come on now. Come on now! I made that same mistake again. There we go. Wait, why did I do that? No, that's not what I needed to do. Come on. I swear it's hard to press those sometimes. Right, I need to rotate these. And then, I can rotate the other ones. There we go. And of course I fell off. Why wouldn't I have fallen off? 
feels like it doesn't create checkpoints while you have an action running. And I fell off again. I wanted to look at it while it was happening, but I guess I'm- the platforms are just too thin for that. Alright. Oh, I can probably put these back in sync now. Oh, come on. Come on! That is not what I wanted to do! That's like three times in a row I've done that now. Or at least three times in this level. Right now, I can do this. There we go. Now there's no possibility of ever getting back over there ever again. We are effectively trapped into doing the solution now. Ah, uh, hmm. Speaking of traps, how do I get out of here? <laughs> oh. Uh, actually I needed these to stay out of sync a bit longer. Come on. My number of actions is gonna be off the charts again, but that's fine. Oops. <laughs> there we go. Now... I need to do this, and then I can resynchronize them. Come on, let me press it please. Right, I might also need to press the other button, though. This one over here. So much walking around! So much walking around! There wasn't this much walking around in Portal 1, or Portal 2, or the Talos Principle. And the Talos Principle even had a sprint key! Oh, come on now. Right, there we go, finally! Oh, I didn't actually go into the exit, apparently. I bet you I could make that jump, but I'm not gonna, because that would be- that would be suicide at this point. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it would trap me as well, if I did manage to make that jump. Yeah, because then I wouldn't be able to go through there, and I'd have to restart the whole level, so let's not. Let's not and say we did. C4. Deaths, 22. Actions, 28. <laughs> oh, man. Right. This will probably be the last one of the episode. Although it looks rather complex, I might have to stop here. Hmm. What is going on? What does this do? Can I press it please? Thank you. Ooh. Now that is interesting. Uh, uh, okay. Interesting. So we can actually rotate the button and rotator. That's neat. Interesting. Uh. Well, I can't do much here, but I can do this. What does that do? Oh, goodness. Sure hope that was something I was supposed to do. What does this do? I sure hope that's something I was supposed to do. Yeah, well, I think we're gonna continue this next episode, so... As always, thank you so much for watching, I really appreciate it, and I'll see you all in another video. Goodbye!